you get together with your family, sometimes with your friends, it's really and truth about getting together with your family and just celebrating being with them and being together. There's no religious aspect to Thanksgiving, so it's a, it's a holiday that everybody celebrates in America. And not everyone celebrates in the same way, but almost everyone makes the same food, which you won't find on any other holiday really in America. So here's the turkey, of course. Usually it's common that one person will carve the turkey for everyone to eat. Usually it's kind of the oldest male or like the, the head of the family. Yeah? So some of the sides that are common are sweet potatoes, green bean casserole, which is disgusting. Uh, <laughs> it's green beans and you put them in kind of a, I guess, cheese sauce. And then there's fried onions on it, and I don't ever touch them. Pumpkin pie. But pumpkin is a type of squash. There's also cranberries, but on uh, Thanksgiving you don't eat them like the fruit. They're turned into a kind of jelly, and you put that on the turkey. Uh, it sounds weird, but it's pretty good. Stuffing is actually cooked inside of the turkey usually, which is kind of gross. Uh, it's made mostly out of bread and seasonings and salt. It's really, really good. It's really terrible for you, but it's really delicious. And then also mashed potatoes with gravy. One of the big traditions, mostly when you're a child, but one of the big traditions is to watch the Thanksgiving Day Parade. And it's hosted by Macy's. And Macy's is a store that's extremely popular in America. It's a department store. And you can find it in pretty much every single town, I think, in America. So yeah, the, the Thanksgiving Day Parade, it's, I think they're up to like the 84th or 85th or something this year, maybe more. But every year they add new characters. So I think they had Shrek, they have SpongeBob, all kinds of things. Spider-Man, they mostly do cartoons because it's easy to make balloons look like a cartoon. It's harder to make it look like a person. They also have pilgrims. The Pilgrims were the first settlers to Massachusetts. They were the ones who started Thanksgiving. They didn't know how to grow food when they got here. And the Native Americans, when they taught them how to fish, gave them seeds and taught them how to grow crops. So they had this big meal together that started the history of Thanksgiving. And then at the end of the parade, every single year, they have Santa Claus. And that's because the, when Thanksgiving is over, that means it's Christmas time. Uh, and also the day after Thanksgiving, it's called Black Friday. And it doesn't have to do with the stock market crashing. And Black Friday is a really big day for shopping. And you can go, a lot of stores open at 2 or 3 or 4 in the morning. And people line up for blocks. They line up all around the store to wait for these big deals. So maybe they have a really cheap price on uh, a TV or a Wii or an Xbox, whatever people are buying these days. So people will line up. They don't go to sleep after Thanksgiving or they go to sleep for an hour and then they go shopping for Christmas the very next day. Kind of a crazy tradition. It can be sometimes kind of violent because maybe there's a hundred TVs and a thousand people who want one. People have gotten hurt in the past. Somebody actually got killed once a few years ago at a Walmart. But it's kind of a lot of fun. I don't usually even buy that much, but it's a tradition me and my mom would always go together. This is the first one I'll be missing in a long time, so I'll, I'll definitely miss Black Friday. The last tradition really for Thanksgiving is football. So after everyone's eaten so much food, if you don't fall asleep. People like to watch football together. They'll watch a football game with their family uh, and drink a lot of beer. Uh, I don't know how they have room after they've eaten so much food. It's a very relaxed holiday. It's about kind of just being with your family, eating a ton of food more than you ever should at any one time. And after you've finished your dinner, you have dessert, of course, and eat way more food than you ever should again. And then just kind of hanging out with your family and watching TV together. If you don't like football, they have all different kinds of television shows on or movies. Every year they show actually uh, The Wizard of Oz. I don't know why, but they show it every year at Thanksgiving. 
It's always the fourth Thursday of every November. Thank you.